and tomorrow is, a, is another challenging fixture with Barnet flying high in the league this season. So uh, what are your thoughts ahead of tomorrow's game? Yeah, a game we're looking forward to. They're obviously flying high, full of confidence and uh, we're searching probably for a um, couple of feel-good moments in the game to, to find our confidence again. Um, we've had a great week's training, um, you know, addressing a few issues. Hopefully what we've, we've encountered so far this season, I think there's been... There's definitely big elements of our game which, and, and parts of our game which shows that we are on the right track and there's probably been a couple of elements which is really the ruthless end in, in both boxes where we haven't probably got the points that we, we deserve uh, on the board at the moment. So um, I say it's refining those, those finer details and, and having that more ruthless edge in, in both boxes and uh, we'd have a lot more points to show for, for, for our efforts. So um, it's taking responsibility now, it's showing courage um, you know, showing desire, showing that that attitude and that aggression in our performances because we're we're not very far away. And like I said, it's just those moments. If we can execute with a little bit more of a clinical edge, um, then we will we will have that confidence. Is what what probably Barnet have got at the moment. Um, but again, another another challenging game, but one we're certainly looking forward to. We've seen a few different um, you know formations throughout the games and, and starting from different games. So can we expect any changes ahead of this Saturday? No, I think the principles are always the same in the way that we play. We want to play with energy, we want to play on the front foot. We're certainly trying to evolve as a group at the moment. Um, we're trying to get the, our best foot forward on the pitch all, all the time. Uh, and like I said, we are growing at the moment and sometimes you grow through your hardships. And we certainly had a tough weekend last weekend where we felt, like I said, the, the elements of the game, we should have been, you know, the chances created. We should have had, you know, points on the board from, from last weekend. That isn't the case. We can't feel sorry for ourselves. We've got to be brutal with ourselves and show that cutting edge and then um, I'm sure we will um, get get the points that we deserve. In terms of uh, yesterday obviously was deadline day for the vast majority of the country, um, we've got a bit more freedom, can we expect to see any more additions or are you happy with the majority of the squad? Um, I think look, you always look want to improve, I'm happy with the with the squad, um, at the moment we're, we're not happy <laughs> because of the, the points hasn't quite, sh I don't think we've got the points to show for our performances. But as, as I said, we can't feel sorry for ourselves. We haven't got those points. So we're coming up short in this certain areas. So we've got to address that. But when I look at the boys in the eyes and I see that the way that we train, the way that we work and the togetherness that we show, I know we're not far away. Um, so I can only focus on what's in the building at the moment. And I'm, I'm happy with what's in the building. Um, I'm sure I look forward to looking back at this period where this was where we grew even quicker and fast tracked a little bit more because we're learning some real harsh lessons at the moment. Um, and I'm sure, you know, we will, when, when we turn it, we'll look back at this situation and, and show that, you know, that, that was the making of us. Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.